Well, Veronica joins us now. She's taking legal action against Miss World. A former Miss Great Britain, Saffron Hart, is here, who says the role demands a lot of time. Veronica, welcome. 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 Uh, congratulations on winning Miss Ukraine. Thank you so much. And my commiserations, commiserations on it got, being taken away. And then got rude. <laughs> Here's the bottom line. You don't dispute that you knew the rule, right? The rule is you, if you enter Miss World, you have to be single and you can't have been married or have kids. And the reason they do that, because uh, I know Julia Morley well, who runs Miss World, is that it's a very full-on thing. I know the current Miss World. She actually came in and did something for my little village cricket team. Uh, it is a very intense, full-on year in which you have to give it everything. And they don't think that a woman who's got kids or you know, a spouse or whatever has the time to do that. What do you say? I think they think the same about a man. Exactly. Well, they do. The, the, the rules men's rules. The, same, the men rule. The men's competition <laughs> rule, has exactly the same rule. You're incapable of looking after your family. Hang on. The men's rule. The men's <laughs> oh, has the same rule. You're more than incapable. Thank you. Apparently, or you can. How can you say the same about Hollywood actor or Olympic athlete who have to be professional in their careers? Also, mm. it means they cannot do their. But roles they will properly. also have had a contract that they had to adhere to, and if they break something in their contract, then they've got the risk of losing their job. So, okay. So that's there's two issues here. Firstly, it's in the contract. Yeah. So, in a way, you knew what you were letting yourself in for, and when you're in breach of those terms, you got sacked, effectively. Yes. But, Saffron, there is a, the other issue, which is how is being a mum a disqualification for being a beauty pageant Well, I personally don't think it is. So, right. when I was looking to enter pageants, I found a system that suited my beliefs, which is you can be a career mummy, and I'm a massive believer in that. Do you I, have kids? I don't have kids, but it's a massive goal for me. Me and my partner work our business, and to be able to work a business and be successful and be parents is something that we strive to be. I think it's fantastic. And so you don't I... want us to go back to the decades where once, if you were a woman and you got a job, you suddenly couldn't work anymore. Absolutely not. So... Because people thought you wouldn't be able to yeah, do Yeah, like everything. we're not in those times anymore. But just to clarify, and... in the men's you know, version of this, yeah. it's the same rule. Exactly. You're not allowed to be married and you're not allowed to have no. kids. So it's not like it's discriminating just for women. No. This is a rule across all these beauty pageants, male and female. For that system. So the system that I went Are with... you're saying no? Saffron represented Miss Great Britain. Yeah, they so don't mine was a different rest... system. So I found a system have restrictions. That, yeah, that fixed that belief. And that's what I went for. So, so is my team. Is yeah, so job? you is could have found job? one that fitted your mm. beliefs as so well. So Miss Great Britain doesn't have that rule. No, no. no. But but what is the, the rule of Miss Great Britain? You can be a mummy, you can be married, um, there is certain guidelines still and you've got to adhere to, but you can still do all that. But for this actual system, those rules have been in place since 1951. Yeah, now, yeah. you signed a thing. contract the job, for that. The rules have been in place from a time when women were expected when... to settle down, have a baby, <laughs> and not work. So much. Exactly. And uh, But it's extraordinary that the rules apply to men as well. Is the job of being Miss World or the equivalent male so onerous that actually they're protecting you by saying your kids wouldn't get to see the sight of you? Yeah, uh, rules are based on the assumptions that women are inferior to men and that women cannot work properly. No, and... because the rules are the same for men and women. Yeah, they're, not, they're not saying that. They're not saying that. No, I know the current Miss World, it is a, she's literally flying around the world the yeah. entire year. Exactly. She doesn't have any moment to breathe, let alone have the time for children I or whatever. totally agree and I just... I, so what would you have done? Had you, had you been allowed to stay in and had you won the Miss World pageant this year, which is in London, by the way. Exactly. If you'd, if you'd won... It's actually in ten days. If you'd won it, what would you, how old is your child? Five. He's what would you have done old. with your child? <laughs> Firstly, uh, would you ask the same question, man? Yes, I would. Yeah. Yeah. So what would you have done with your child? <laughs> OK, so I was a successful fashion model for five years. Sure. And I've been travelling around the world with Alex for five years. Do so you I just thought... take him around? It's sure. where's, he, where's he at school? Uh, in Ukraine. Right, five he, goes, years. he goes to kindergarten now. So you would take him out of school. Five, he's going to go to a big school oh, soon, right? Look at him. So there he is, sweet little chap. Little and he's, you know, he's the unwitting uh, victim of all this. Nothing to do with you, mate. <laughs> well, um, alternatively, he's not a victim <laughs> at all. Well, he, can do, he, can he do was the... having an extraordinary experience. He, he, can, look, he can go on the Greta Thunberg the holiday tour, really? but, uh, <laughs> but actually, isn't there a reality check? You're going to take him out of school, take him around the world for a whole year without a break? It's up to me how to yeah, manage this. Yeah, I think the thing this. is, you've been a very successful model already, so you've actually personally proved that you can be a mummy exactly. and be successful in a career, but the point is, for this system, you broke the rule. <laughs> and you knew you were breaking and... the rules, didn't you? You did. You knew the rule. You lied, um... right? You did lie. So, when I was filling uh, in the application form, 
then I found out the rule existed. Yeah, but what did, but you, say honestly, on the, what did you say on the phone? Hang on, hang on. What did you say on the phone? When it said to you, are you married? Have you got no. children? What did you say? No, there are rules. And if you don't agree, you cannot apply. But what did you say? You, sign, you check the box. So you lied? <laughs> you did, didn't you? <laughs> OK. OK, I don't because, mind. Well, <laughs> hang on, you Look, say it's rules... It's not the biggest crime in the, in the world to admit <laughs> you've got a kid, right? You say <laughs> rules are made to be broken. And if you disagree with the rule no, actually, that Miss World or Miss Retreat actually, no, I don't. shouldn't no. have a child, I think the general then rules why of, not The general rules, rules of life are a malleable thing. But, but I think organisations are perfectly entitled, or rather like a private club, I think organisations are perfectly entitled to set their own rules, and if you sign up to them and you and you exactly. lie, I, totally I think they're entitled to boot you out, aren't they? I totally agree. And you uh, want the rules to change? I want the rules to change. Yes. Uh, yeah. To be to clarify, at this moment when I was filling the application form, I was a successful fashion model, signing like many contracts, go through many application mm. forms. It's women, you know, women who have kids are beautiful. Okay. Of course they are. Honestly, um, and maybe it's... we should have a hot mum beauty pageant. Oh, there is. Yeah. Look, uh, let's do uh, it. Why not? Let's do it. Let's do that. Exactly. <laughs> There's that many pageants out there now. Let's you have a pageant have a hot for hot mums <laughs> with kids, right? I do and then not. it's a different I do thing. still get people saying there was something wrong Leave with Leave Miss World as it is with their rules. It's <laughs> yeah. Great. There's it's so it. many different pageant systems out there now that there hot is something Hot mamas with kids, everyone. right? Exactly. I'd watch. I, yes. <laughs> watch, they're all like you. You can How did you manage to make it sound so sleazy? It's not sleazy. It's a celebration of female beauty, isn't it? Absolutely. Equally. Of course, yeah. and our rules were written like 70 years ago. Here's the positive for you. Here's the positive for you. When women You are now the most famous Miss Ukraine in history. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations. Well done for breaking yeah. the rules. Good to see you both. Thank yeah. you Thank so you much. much. In a statement, the Miss World organisation said Veronica gave false information on her application form was disqualified by the Miss Ukraine organisation. Miss World rules are set with the principal aim of finding a winner who is free and able to commit, often at short notice, to travel globally in support of sick and disadvantaged, which may be for long periods of time. Yep, it's in the rule book. If you tick the wrong box, it's like anything. You try doing that with your visa or your passport, all hell breaks loose. I had so many arguments. You know what? It's lovely to see you. Really nice. Congratulations on winning anyway, even if it didn't last very long. Thank you so much.